what's up everybody Freddy C here and welcome back to Grand Theft Auto 5 online for the final mission for the Cluckin' Bells raid that's right baby it's time for the big raid itself but first let's contact Vincent and give him an update hey it's my pleasure to inform you that we have officially completed all necessary preparations to move forward with the clucking bell operation at your earliest convenience. Let's make this happen. You got it, brother man. Now, for the first video of the clucking bells uh, gameplay, uh, slush fun was part one. Part two was breaking and entering. Part three was the raiding of concealed weapons and the hit and run thing, you know, the vehicles. Part four was the disorganized crime thing, which was pretty short, but necessary. <laughs> and now it's time for the fifth and final part. This is the finale, the scene of the crime. Let's go. We're now ready to raid the Cluckin' Bells factory and shut down the cartel's coke operation once and for all. Let's do this! <laughs> we're about to shut down a cartel and we're about to disrupt their operations for good, baby! Oh man, how I love disrupting enemy operations. I bet you the uh, reward is going to be big b -b box. <laughs> oh man. That box. Under the circumstances, your customary silence is a little concerning. Should I have added air holes? Cut twice if you're in trouble. Okay, good. Now remember, when you burst out of that crate, You'll be in the heart of that operation. How you choose to use the element of surprise is up to you. This is it. Good luck. All right. Perfect. Professionals armor, gear, equipment. Let's see, tactical SMG. To punch fatal holes in the hull of this operation, we need to leave with two things. Their product and their cash. Hmm. To clarify, steal it all. Don't forget the extra gear your crew procured. Feel free to experiment. It should be in a dumpster to the rear of the factory. You see, it pays to befriend your local garbage man. Nah, I got what I need. Tactical SMG, heavy rifle, and a heavy shotgun. As well as pipe bombs. Okay. I'm gonna need to take out some of these thugs quietly. One shot to the head. Perfect. where things are going to get a little complicated here. Someone's coming. Someone's coming. Okay, can't let him spot me. So just stay where I am. Okay, it should be good. Oh, 
shoot, he's coming back. Time to raid him. Hmm. Surprisingly, they didn't raise any alarms. That was close. It's clear this place is barely functioning as a chicken factory. One would assume they'd have more cock and bell staff to keep up appearances, but I underestimated just how bold criminals can be once they have the police in their pocket. The key card you acquired should grant you access to restricted areas in the factory, including the basement. Right, okay. As I stealthily take these guys out, we should be good to go. Office, but I still need to raid some of the coke storage areas. Now, something tells me that once I start raiding those storage areas, the alarms are going to sound, and they're going to be on to me. But I took out their backup up at the surface. Taking these guys out without alerting their crew isn't going to be easy. But then again, neither is sneaking past them. the coke. I gotta take this as evidence. Well, so far, no alarms have been raised. That's good. Looks like we're doing something right here because, uh, I don't know, I'm not getting any unnecessary attention. Well, not yet, at least. That's like thousands and thousands of dollars worth of illegal stuff that these guys are making. Well, thanks to my expertise, this is all coming to an end. Back to the factory floor. Next. Hmm. Oh yeah, key card. Let's see what's in here. Bar around here somewhere I can use. Ah, hello. Okay. Let's see what's in this box. Ooh. Hello. That's one bag. Oh, empty. All right, let's check the other two. Bingo. Any 
extras? Don't nope. forget to vacate the contents of the safe too. Well, that one's empty. Alright, so we successfully raided some areas without raising any alarms. Now we gotta go to the office. So far so good. I mean there's no there's no alarms, there's no trouble. Nothing. Well for now. Okay, let's hack the computer. Connect to the computer to initialize the hack. Just gotta keep following the blue. Second one over there. there. Are multiple connections. You need to hack each one before you have to go. That's two. There's three. Okay. okay, that should have done it. Have you received the safe code? Yeah, the safe code is 259609. Right. Maybe I should just keep that aimed up a little bit until I can actually memorize it by memory. Check Sometimes. The device for the code to the safe. Yeah, I'm already doing that. Okay, twenty five ninety six oh nine. Five ninety six oh nine. Got it. Nice. Uh oh. Excellent. That's everything. Alarms are raised. Where the action means of escape is still a getaway vehicle that you stashed in the garage. This is where the action is going to intensify. Second I get in that vehicle, they're gonna be all over me. Which means I gotta be quick fast and I gotta evade. Time to go. who I am. Unless I do this trick. All 
All right, the raid went well until I got to the safe, which triggered the alarm. If I just follow these train tracks without avoiding, well, while avoiding all the traffic jams, I should be able to reach the lockup in no time. I must say, the raid went perfectly well. Last time I had to kill a bunch of cartel thugs in order to get out of there, but... This time, I did it right. I did it the way it was supposed to go down. With the proper equipment, and so on and so forth. Oh shoot, here they come. Can't catch me, bitches. Oh, oh shoot. <laughs> Suckers. Uh oh. Can't catch me, Kaparamas. Oh, they really want their stuff back. Sorry, pal. You ain't getting it back. damage to the vehicle, but hey, better than running into those uh, stingers, you know, spikes in the road that cops usually use to stop getaway vehicles. <laughs> Sometimes, ow. oh, my foot, ah, they really, really hurt, I almost hurt my foot there, ow. Uh, what was I going to say? Oh, yeah. Sometimes you have to just adapt and improvise. intensifies once you're done raiding the place. Then that's when things get a little complicated between the bad guys and the Kaparamas. than that, Vincent. First, let me just lose the heat. Then I'll deliver the rest of the lockup. Alright. Heat's been lost. Nice. Lost the heat. Perfect. Well, that was a successful raid. Went off without a hitch. Had to kill a couple of bad guys in the process while getting away. But you know what? All in all, I gotta say, it's a job well done. 
All I need to do is just go to the lockup. Vincent will give me a reward. And the Cluck and Bells raid gameplay, split into different parts, that is, is finally over. Thanks, Vincent. I gotta admit, quite apart from that. Yeah, sorry, I didn't get to hear the rest of that. Excellent work, mission accomplished. Now to the vital matter of payment. As I'm sure you can appreciate, there are certain transactions I can't be party to as an officer of the law. But if I've learned anything from my consociates on the LSPD, it's how to look the other way. Now remember, as far as I'm concerned, you can hit that factory as often as you'd like. As long as you're giving me reasons to keep looking the other way, I'm happy. As you can see from my choice of transportation, my fortunes at the LSPD are also improving. Just got these babies in, fresh off the line. <laughs> Guess who picked one up? Until next time, I'll just disassociate. Not gonna lie, that is a pretty cool looking cop ca car. Whoa! 500,000 bucks? That's like half a million dollars! <laughs> if only my camera could at least capture my face, you would have been able to see the expression on my face. I can come over right now. How's it hanging? I haven't been over in But weeks. what the heck? At least the Cluckin' Bells raid is over. Hey, Mike, what's up? Hey, honey. How are you? I know, man. That was and an extra 250,000. Yeah. Well, I guess it's back to doing some regular jobs for Franklin Clinton now that the Cluckin' Bells raid is over. Hello? I wanted to confirm that your compensation is in your account. And of course, to congratulate you again on a successful operation. Our efforts to derail the Clucking Bell Cartel's efforts were indeed effective, but it won't be long before they and their corrupt counterparts in the LSPD rebuild their little enterprise. Each and every time we knock them back down, I'll ensure it's worth your while. Effenberger up. Well, I do appreciate Vincent's honesty. All right, well, I'm on my way to the agency and uh, doing a couple of jobs for Mr. Franklin Clinton. Now that the Cluckin' Bells cartel group is out of business and their coke operations have been stopped, I guess it's safe to say that the Cluckin' Bells raid gameplay is officially over. So, guys, did you like how I stealthily raided the... Clucking Bell Farm Factory and disrupt their operations. <laughs> if you liked how I did it, you know, stealth and all, a little bit of action on the getaway, let me know in the comments section below this video. I would love to hear your thoughts and appearance. Uh, appearance. <laughs> Listen to me. Thoughts and appearance. <laughs> I meant to say thoughts and opinions. <laughs> I'm saying the wrong words again. I would like to hear your thoughts and opinions on how the Cluckin' Bells raid went down. You know, just, just let me know what you guys thought about it. And uh, also, don't forget to drop some likes and don't forget to subscribe to my YouTube channel. And definitely turn on those notifications because you definitely would want to know when I'm going to upload something in the near future. I upload my gaming videos once a day, so... Yeah, depending on which game I play. Maybe like one video per game a day or something like that. And yeah, 
Anything as long as you turn on those notifications, you'll be notified for when I've uploaded them or not. All you gotta do is just subscribe to the YouTube channel and just let the notifications do what they gotta do. And thank you guys again for watching this. This was the last mission for the Cluckin' Bells raid. Now I'm about to do some agency missions for Franklin. So let me just come up here and get some armor while I'm at it. And I will see you in my next GTA 5 gameplay, which won't be until a little after June 25th, when the, uh, the, you know, what was it called again? Oh, bottom dollar bounties happen. And Hi. until that happens, this is Freddy C signing off for now, but I'll be back in action soon. Have a great day. Yeah, I don't fuck with weed. Makes me anxious. <laughs> Every time Lamar walks in smiling like that, I want to try it again. <laughs> Anyways, we don't need to do Got hear that. Much everything in here. Yeah, we didn't really need to hear that. So anyways, <clears throat> thank you guys for watching this video. Keep your eyes open. And I will see you in my next gameplay. And until then, I'm signing off for now, but I'll be back in action soon. So like I said, stay cool. And stay safe out there because it is a heat wave out there. Stay hydrated too. Alright? I'll see you guys next time.